we haven't really talked a lot about eight and one or seven and one. We're talking about like our game and where we can where we can improve the things we like about it. So that's the way I am. Maybe the players are thinking different. I don't know. I mean, it's you obviously. Hey, we like where we're at. We we feel like we've we've done some good things to get here. But I th I think there's lots more upside in our group yet. So hopefully that's what we're thinking. I think that's what they're thinking. But that being said, you know it's going to be a. Uh, a very nice tribute to a Oiler legend, and we all know about how many legends came out of that era. So it's uh, it's it's neat for players to see that. I mean, I I look at it. I probably look at it different than young players do. I played against all these guys for a long time, and it's uh, it's way better to be on their side. Put it that way. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, obviously, he was a good player for a long time. I mean, we had a guy the other night hit 1,200. That's pretty, pretty crazy to think. So being in the league as long as I have, um, you know, it's hard to imagine those kind of numbers. To be honest, it's obviously well deserved. Long time coming. I mean, when a guy has a career like that I and mean, does it, what he did for an organization like that, kind of being the backbone on the back end there for so many years, and I think especially what he does outside of the game of hockey too is probably his biggest asset. So. Um, it's going to be fun. It's obviously well deserved and it should be a great evening for him. Well, I think as a player, it's pretty special to be a part of something like this, especially with this franchise and you know what Kevin has done. So um, as far as that goes, I think we've got a veteran group in there that'll be ready when the puck drops and uh, you know, we're looking forward to celebrating this with them. I went to management there to start. I didn't want it to be something that had to come up. Um, you know, I was very thankful that I was able to wear, get the opportunity to wear number four. Selfishly, I think it's great for me that I was the last guy to wear it before it goes up for Mr. Lowe. But uh, to be honest, when I got here, there, there wasn't. They just asked what number I wanted. I had, wanted. I had some success with number four, and I asked, and um, they said that would be all right. I, kn I knew kind of the background a little bit. I took a lot of pride in wearing that number because I knew who had it before me, obviously. So it's. Uh, I find it special that I got the opportunity to wear it.